Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Zombie Potato. This is Factorio Undefeatable. We're just going to repair these walls first, and then we're going to head back down, and we're going to continue on the work to retrieve stone, which is actually really, really, really important because we bloody well need it. We really do. We want to make reinforced walls, and we currently do not have the ability to do that. We also want to start up a uh, stone production area, like a stone processing area sort of thing. We also, uh, well, have not had the opportunity to do that quite yet, because we haven't needed to. Now, now we do. Now we have a need, a reason, a desire, a burning passion to build stone stuff. So we're going to go ahead, and we're going to get some stone stuff. Um... Unfortunately, we do not have any furnaces. No, I tell a lie. I We do have a couple of furnaces on us, which is fine. Um, we're going to need to correct something here. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't pick up any inserters. That is kind of annoying. That's, that's not a problem. We'll go up and get them in just a second. However, let me just take this down here. Okay, so that's going to go there. I haven't fucked this, have I? I haven't fucked this. Tell me I haven't fucked this, please. Tell me I haven't fucked this. And then you go there. Okay, I haven't fucked it. That's fine. That's great. That's grand. I haven't fucked it. It's working. It's going to continue to work. And as soon as we deploy all of this belt, it should work the bestest that it's ever worked before. Um, also, this might be a pretty good chance to pick up all of this ammo and then replace it with decent ammo that we're really, we want to push out. The the extra special ammo, should I say. I'll just collect it all up. There we go. Yeah, so extra special ammo uh, should be the ammo of choice from now on. If I can get a fast inserter here, then we should be able to... Uh, push it out at a little bit of a faster rate. Not like it particularly matters, but uh, you know, just for just for good measure, really. Uh, and let's get the regular inserter. Stick that there instead. Perfect. All right. Now, where am I producing regular inserters? I'm producing them up here. How many do I have banked up? None. Oh my god! I've got no inserters banked up. Oh god, that's annoying. Uh, okay, well, at least we can get the stone from here, because that will allow us to make a bunch more furnaces for the stone production area. But we've got no... We've got no regular inserters. Are you actually kidding me? Okay, we need to cap you. Quite frankly. We do not need as much uh, green science packs as we've got now. We, we've got a lot of green science packs. We've got a lot of them. Okay, there we go. That's fine. We've got a shit ton of green science packs, quite frankly. And... Don't really know if there's any way to avoid that. But it's fine. It's, it's okay. That's a little bit of a setback, quite frankly. Because I didn't really want to build my own inserters. But I guess we're going to have to build, like, 50 inserters or whatever. So, yeah, that's annoying. Shit happens, you know? You know, homie? Shit happens. It's the way that the cookie crumbles. Uh, let's build just a shit ton, and then I'll feel better about myself, and about my horrific woes. Alright, let's head back down, and see what's going on. Uh, yeah, we have nowhere near enough inserters. We're gonna need way more. We, we effectively need two for every turret that's been placed. Two for every... Well, no, that's a lie. Not two for every turret that's been placed. One for every turret that's been placed. However, two for every, like, little section. You know? Like, little slice. Does that make sense? I, I have a feeling that it just doesn't make sense at all. Uh, okay. There. There. You cheeky fuck. Alright. Turns out we did have enough inserters... I was a little bit panicky there, because I didn't think that we were gonna for a while, but turns out that we did, so, you know, it's, it's all okay, I guess. It's all fine. Uh, there. There. 
there. And that's all, that's all, folks. We have no more wood. No more wood at all. Not at all. Okay, well, at least we can get started with that little bit, which is fine. We can pop up here just to get a little bit of wood because there's a whole bunch of tree farming stuff going on over here, which should still be going fine, right? What? Why have we not got... Did this whole thing stop? How did it stop? We had we were going great. We were doing a really good job. That's super annoying, actually. Huh. I thought that we would be fine. I guess I was wrong. Um, oh, well, no biggie. Well, we've still got this area, which is going strong, which is really nice. It's doing me proud, getting lots of wood. Which is lovely. I'll pick up all of that wood, thank you very much, and I'll build a bunch of small electric poles. I just fucking I don't want to I don't want to constantly be moving around our defenses. I want to actually push on and uh, and get the stone area sorted out. But if we don't if we don't do this, then I'm gonna come back and regret it. Um, you are building the clockwork rifle bot. You're not building. You're just assembling. That's fine. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Um. Yeah, alright. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's dark again. It's always fucking dark. There we go. Speaking of dark and the power, how is our power? Our power is absolutely A-OK, -okay, 100%. Never talk to me again sort of thing. Yeah, our power is fine. We don't need to worry about it. Okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. Perfect. Alright. This whole area is going to be super fortified, which is great, but it also means that, a, you know, there's a bunch of other areas, quite frankly, which are not fortified, uh, that could do with being fortified. So, we will need to consider that. Uh, you know, for example, for example, this area up here is not fortified. This area up here is not fortified. This area up here is fortified, this area down here is fortified, but this area primarily is our weak point. Specifically over here, there's only like a couple of turrets over there. Uh, we've got no ammo refill belt over there or anything, so it's pretty dodgy. Pretty damn dodgy. Um, I'm going to take a couple of electric mining drill mark twos, and I'm going to start them trying to mine up all of this tin ore. Because I think that we have a good shot of being able to get rid of all of this tin ore before... Um, before we get here and, you know, build over it with all of our furnaces and stuff, because that's pretty much what I plan on doing. Um, I'll get a couple more stone furnaces just so that we can do just that. Uh, you go there. You go there. As many, as many does as we possibly can here. Yeah, one more. One more. Perfect, that's grand. It's, it's good enough for me, I guess. It's fine. Steel, steel, steel. It's not exactly perfect, but nothing in life is. Yeah, there's a lot of resources that are expected to be taken out of the ground here, but I'm very hopeful that we'll be able to drill them up at a very, very fast rate. The important thing, however, is getting all of the resources that we need to get home. We just need to get them all back up to where... Um, where we can process them. And getting them back up safely as well, that's also a pretty big deal. Seven objects are being damaged, three targets are engaged with the enemy, fingers crossed that goes okay. Uh, electric, shit, no, 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 no. Not uh, large mining drills, we need just need the regular Mark IIs, thank you. That's grand. Uh, and we'll just place them up here, which should be fine, I think. Uh, stone has already come out of the ground, which is lovely. The heck is that? Steel? Why is steel just sitting on the ground over there? Did I drop it? Hmm, weird. Um, no sweat. Nothing to worry about. Okay. Where are we going to have the entrance point? Could have it... I think over here sounds like a good, good enough place to be, to be honest. I mean, anywhere would really have done it. But, um... 
here especially is fine. Okay. There we go. And a little bit of underground belt for good measure. Why not? Come on, come on, come on. Perfect. All right. There we go. There we go, indeed. All right, this is going to be the area where we process a whole bunch of stone. And I'm very, very hopeful that it works out perfectly. It never will, though. It, it never. Life never works out perfectly. Um, all right. How many furnaces do we have here at our disposal? We've got seven at our disposal. Could we get a couple more? Three more, maybe? Yeah, ten. It's not great, but... It'll do, I guess. Okay. Yeah. So this is going to be the start of the coal production area. W there is a chance that we need just some regular coal. So I'm going to try and... Uh, not some regular coal. I keep on saying coal when I mean stone. It's a, a very funny slip of the tongue. A very... No, not funny in a... You know, like a ha ha ha, I'm so funny sort of way. Funny in a strange way. Like, why do I keep on saying it? Don't really understand it. Um, I think we're going to try and keep that to three stacks of stone. That's right, I'm saying it properly. Stone. Uh, let's keep that to three stacks of stone, and then everything else can be done out with that. Yeah, we'll just try and we'll just we'll just turn the rest of it into stone bricks. Quite frankly, the main reason that we need stone is for walls, at least right now, anyway. Um, it's pretty much the big dealio. Uh, stone walls is the big deal. So, let's... Steel chests, probably overkill, to be honest. Wooden chests should do just fine. Yeah. Perfect. Eh, it's decent enough, I suppose. Yeah. 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 Yep, and yep. Okay. Fingers crossed that that will work. Now, we do need to connect some sort of a power source to that, and coal was my choice of... My, my choice of choice was my preference. Um, there's a coal belt over there. I guess we could sort of siphon off that if we had to. I need to go and get a, you know, some iron for a splitter. That's annoying that we have to go all the way back up here again. Man, robots. Robots are going to be good. Robots are going to be good. Stuff is getting destroyed. I really dislike when stuff gets destroyed. It's really not a great sign. Uh, a couple of splitters. Oh. Shit, we are... We are out of everything, really. Uh, let's keep you limited to that. That's more than more than enough, I think. There's a little bit of a build-up over there. The dude got destroyed over here. Was it over here? Did, was it the the target destroyed over here? Is that is that the issue? I don't know. I don't know where the where the issue uh, came from. But that is annoying nonetheless that it happened. And also. If we have a look at this process over here, you can see that we do not have enough of the dust stuff. Although, we... We actually kind of do. We're kind of just being trading even or whatever, so that's, that's, we're, we're trading evenly. That's kind of nice. Okay, over here where the coal is sweet and the girls are pretty, let's do this. You know, you know what else is crazy to me, right? Is that all of these belts in Factorio, none of them require power. They just don't require power at all. They're just completely unpowered belts that just just work. Uh, excuse me? That's not what I want you to do. That is uh, super not what I want you to do. Okay. And then this... And this way, we do not have any more belt. Oh my god. Why, 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 why? That's very, very, very intensely annoying. We'll go and pick up some of this ammo belt. 
This ammo belt, by the way, existed for literally two episodes before it was torn down and reconfigured in some way. Um, honestly, I think that's for the better. Uh, the more that you tear down stuff, the better it can be built up. Hashtag emotional. There we go. Now we're talking. This is going to be truly great. I'm really, really, really excited. Finally, we're, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. That feels strange, but great at the same time. Two turrets are engaged with the enemy. That's not a problem. It's not a problem. Uh, yeah, this should... This should produce an awful lot of stone. Like, an awful lot of stone. Like, a lot of stone. I'm really actually rather excited about it. Uh... Du -du 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 -du. You over there, you over there, perfect. Yeah, this is going to be a pretty big stone area. Okay, break that off. Come around here, put that in there. Yeah, just so that it always maintains one side of the belt. Not like it particularly matters. I mean, two sides of the belt would allow us to ship more resources up here, but... Ah, whatever. It doesn't really matter that much. Um, what I am going to do, though... Is I am gonna... Uh, how do we build the... Oh yeah, that's just basic stone. Perfect. Well, let's go into our stone chest and get out a bunch of basic stone. Not enough ingredients. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's just place this down, place this down, place that down, place that down, that down. Perfect. Uh, and what we can do here is we can have sort of a, an input area. You know, when all of the stone is shipped in from uh, you know areas outside wherever they may be. We'll just have a place where we can, you know, stick them all into chests, basically. So, a couple of chests there. A couple of inserters. A couple of inserters. Can we build one more? Ah, that'll do. We can extend this uh, as we go, if we need to. That there, and that there. Perfect. And... This stone can just be put on this belt. Although it needs to go specifically onto one side of the belt, doesn't it? I forgot about that. As you can probably tell by the fact that I I built something. Okay, so there's literally no reason not to uh, not to have this going on both sides of the belt the whole way. Now that we've reconfigured so that we switch the side of the belt further to the base. Uh... Yep, so this can just go straight up there like that. And we should be fine. Another turret has been destroyed. That is very, very, very irritating because I was kind of hoping for more turrets not to be destroyed. Yeah, we can extend this if we need to, but it'll have to do for now. Um, we're going to be getting so many stone bricks that it's not even going to be funny. We're honestly in a pretty decent position. Okay, four burner mining drills. What was what was up there? Oh shit. Excuse me? There we go. Okay. Now I'm shooting. What was in the burner mining drills? Oh shit, we were mining stone over there. Oh, that is annoying. That's annoying. I completely forgot about that stone output uh, that stone base over there. Honestly. Who gives a shit? Doesn't really matter to us uh, to us at all, considering we've now set up a full-fledged stone building area, stone processing area. What the fuck are you doing over here? What the fuck is this? You are... you are... dead. That's what you are. That's really weird. This area is also super unprotected, and we really could do with defending it better. Um... Yeah, I want to I wanna work on that, actually. Uh, not in this episode, but it is going to be something that we need to do. Something to look into for future, for uh, for sure. Let's take half of you. Let's put in a gun turret. Oh. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Put you in there. And let's just shoot the bases now, basically. Because any, any dudes who get within the turret's range should be just all taken out. If we sustain a little bit of damage... Oh. 
Oh, what's that, worms? You're dead? Didn't quite hear you over all the dying that you were doing. Alright. It's dark, I know. Nothing much that I can really do. Tungsten over there, copper over there, gold over there. A bunch of variety in the ores that we have access to. Very, very encouraging. This bodes this bodes well for the future. This absolutely does. Okay, it's dark, it's almost midnight. Not in reality, in the uh, in the game. My name has been Obed Potato, this has been the end of this episode. This has been Factorio Undefeatable. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!